Hello Capricorn, welcome to my channel. My name is Isabel from the tarotempress.com. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm going to be doing your tarot card reading now. We're just going to focus on your love life. Okay, so we have the energy of someone coming towards you, okay? I'm going to be exploring this energy in more detail in the clarification part. Okay, so what I see from the cards is an indication that for some of you, there is this individual that is coming towards your direction. I feel like this person is looking for love, interested in a potential relationship with you, looking for, you know, some sort of connection as well. I feel like this individual is uh, thinking about a romantic relationship. There's a very high possibility of that, okay? Now, the difficulty they're having at this point of time is communicating their feelings to you, right? So that energy is showing to me that they're feeling blocked from saying certain things or from, uh, you know, doing certain things in the course of the relationship. There's a desire to, you know, open up their heart, open up their soul, say certain things that are you know, romantic in nature, okay? So let's start clarifying the cards. Okay, so I feel like this person enjoys talking to you. I also see from the cards that they're thinking a lot about having a romantic relationship, okay? There is an indication from these cards that this individual has been obsessing over making a move or doing something in regard to, you know, a potential relationship. So that is on their mind, a very high priority. So I do pick up that energy. But let's see, you know... What do the oracle cards have to say about this energy? Okay, so this individual feels very inspired by you, okay? I feel like they feel very motivated in terms of their life. There's something about your nature, your personality that is making this person feel like they can accomplish anything, okay? So you have become the muse of an individual. I do feel like uh, they feel a great sense of passion in their day-to-day -day life. It could be, you know, wanting to get to know you better. I'm getting the impression from this card that this individual feels like the possibilities are just endless when it comes to what this relationship can accomplish. Okay, so that's a very interesting energy that this individual is feeling at this point of time. Let's see, why are they feeling blocked from communicating their love and feelings for you? Yeah, I'm 
getting the impression that this person that you're dealing with, you know, they might be aware that you've had some difficulties, but I'm also feeling like they don't feel like they have a direct access to you, you know. The cards are indicating that uh, there's a fear of you not taking them seriously or perhaps overlooking them or not uh, being as interested in them as they are in you. So they do have that fear of reaching out. There's something that's on their mind, something that is troubling them, something that they're worried about, you know, in terms of making a move and uh, getting their feelings for you out there. So I see that this individual is holding back a lot, but um, they do feel a sense of loneliness. I feel like they are holding back um, from taking a chance, holding back from grabbing an opportunity of a relationship, even though they have some pretty strong emotions for you, okay? So that's very interesting. I feel like this individual is a little bit reserved about making a move. The next card is indicating that, um, you know, someone is thinking about starting a new chapter, but this card also indicates leaving an old chapter behind in order to do so. So I feel like this individual could be wanting you to, you know, move forward in a certain sense, or you could be waiting for them to make a move. But I'm definitely picking up here the intention of movement, right? But let's see what's behind that. So what I'm seeing is this sort of need to move beyond difficulties, conflicts, leave behind certain things from the past and to turn a page, right? The energy is giving me the sense that um, if you've had some difficult relationships or if you've had some ups and downs in terms of your, you know, um, love life, I feel like the cards are indicating that you can pull through some of these difficult moments. You don't have to feel stuck in terms of uh, those energies. What I'm also seeing is that, you know, this person might have made their intentions known to you at some point during the course of the relationship. So I do feel like, you know, this individual may have, you know, given you an indication through some of the things they've said or done, you know, in the past you know, to either imply or to make their feelings known to you. And what I'm seeing is that um, their love for you is something that is getting more and more romantic. And I do sense from the cards uh, that they want to make a move, right? Because I see here in the external influences that they are making plans, right? And they are hoping for changes. But these are the type of changes that they want in regard to having a successful relationship. Let's look at what type of romance they're bringing into your life. Wow, this is, this is amazing. Four of Wands. For some of you, this could be resulting in um, a stable commitment. Could be a relationship. Could be marriage, right? Very powerful card to come out. And uh, very indicative of uh, what could be happening in your life during this period of time. I do feel like, you know, it's uh, going to move fast. This individual... You know, if you're a female, they could be an alpha male or they could be somebody, you know, if you're a male, it could be uh, someone that um, is very driven, someone that um, likes to get things done and doesn't hesitate, doesn't hold back. So I do feel like, um, you know, they could be waiting in the backdrop of your life to make a move or to do something in regard to this relationship. Right. 
Okay, so let's look very quickly at this person's feelings. Yes, I'm getting this card again, right? This card is uh, in alignment with this. It's basically the same card, but for it to come out, it's indicating that they have some very strong, you know, attraction for you. I feel like they want to seduce you. There's definitely that indication there. I see that they see you as someone that is uh, very, very strong, but they also see you protective of your own well-being and... Um, I feel like they understand this, but I also sense, you know, a lot of energies here that are highlighting, you know, leaving behind certain old energies in order to move forward in this direction. So this individual could be waiting for that. I hope you guys enjoyed your tarot card reading. If you want a personal one, you can get it at the tarotempress.com. Have a wonderful day and take care.